Hey Mountain Family, so today I am doing another grocery haul. I got a request to do one and I've been working on that list of requests that you all put in my, that video. I've been working on it. Uh, some things I can't do until I get an actual camera, but some things I can do like this. So I'm going to do a grocery haul video today. Before I do that, I'm um, going to show you guys what I do. I try to do this before I go to the grocery store. I try to write down things that I'm going to make this week or in the next two weeks. Uh, so I'm wanting to do a corn, red onion, and black bean quesadilla with avocado and mango salsa. So I got the stuff to do that. I want to make a pho. Never made one before, but it looks really, really good. So I got the stuff to do that. I was going to make banana bread pancakes, but I got in the store and I found pears and green apples. So I'm going to make a pear, green apple, and cinnamon pancake instead. I'm going to try a quinoa breakfast porridge. I've seen it all over Pinterest. It looks really, really good. So I'm going to try it. And I'm craving uh, Chinese food, but I want it um, vegetable lo mein. I want it vegan. So <laughs> I'm going to make vegetable lo mein. So I got the stuff to make that as well. And then the rest of the stuff I got was just like other meals that I could think of to put together. But these are just specific things that I wanted. So I'm going to show you guys like the vast difference between what I've bought and what Devin's bought over there. <laughs> really big difference. But I'm going to start over here with the mass of vegetables. I might have to put some of these bags like in the floor. Ooh, speaking of, I'm going to start down here. I got potatoes, um, halo oranges for the girls, and sweet potatoes. I love sweet potatoes. If you're on my social media, you know I love, I love sweet potatoes. But anyway, we got that. We got some carrots. The girls love baby carrots, and I do too. I'm going to have to set that right here on the floor. Um, corn on the cob. You know what? There's a little table right there. I'm going to set that right there. Cauliflower. Just one head of cauliflower. We got it. A head of lettuce. This is just, um, oh, I just lost my train of thought. <laughs> this is for salads. Um, I like salads for lunch sometimes. I got some shallots. No, this is not shallots. This is ginger. My bad. It was brown. So I was like, shallots. No, this is my ginger. Um, this is for, what is this for? Is this, yeah, this is for the pho. I got, is this the spinach or the, yeah, this is spinach because I got this. And I already have some kale in the fridge that I bought just a couple of days ago. So this and this spin, baby spinach and kale will make a nice salad. Um, what else am I going to pick up here? Garlic. What is this for? I bought this specifically. I think this goes in the flat too. I have to look at the recipe. I'm going to try to smush a couple of recipes together. These are my shallots. I don't know what I'm going to make with shallots. Please don't ask. I, I, I don't know. I'm just going to get experimentive and figure out what I'm going to do. These are my green bell peppers. These are a bunch of avocados. I'm going to make some guacamole. So I needed a bunch of, gua of uh, avocados. Plus, I just like eating them in salads and stuff. So I got like five of these suckers. Yellow bell peppers. What is this? Is this my cucumbers or zucchini? Because they look the same. Cucumber. I got two cucumbers. These are my Roma tomatoes. Some asparagus. These are habanero peppers. This is Devin's idea. I will not be eating these. These are Devin's. Cilantro. This is both for the pho and for the um, quesadillas. Three turnips. I really like turnips. If you've never had one, they're really good if you pan fry them in some salt and pepper. With some, you pan fry them in olive oil. Or if you're not vegan, you can pan fry them in butter. They're really, really good. They're kind of bland, though, so you really do have to season them. Two red onions. Green tomatoes. I'm going to see if I can fry them. I love fried green tomatoes. See if I can figure out how to do that. Shiitake mushrooms. That is for the pho. Zucchini. I love zucchini. What did I get? Like four of these? Yeah, four zucchinis. I love zucchini. An eggplant, because I love eggplant, too. One of the other things that I really love. Uh, green onions. This is for the pho and the vegetable lo mein. Oh, vegetable lo mein. 
I have not been telling you guys what I'm going to put in that. Oh, jeez. I'm sorry. Bok choy. This is for the vegetable lo mein. Ta-da! <laughs> That's what... There's one thing I'm going to put in it. I'm also going to put some um, of the carrots, the baby carrots that you all saw. I'm going to put some of that in. I'm going to have to like, cut them up or something, but I'm going to do that. And some bok choy and probably some red onion. I don't know. I'll figure it out. I got some marjoram. I don't know how to say that, and I've never used this before. I don't know what this is. It was in the, um, I know what I'm trying to say. Give me a second. Spice aisle, and it was on sale, and I Googled it, and I was like, oh, you just put it with this, 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 and this. And I was like, well, I can try it, see what it tastes like, and see what it does. So I'm going to do that. I mean, if I really like it, I just might add it to my herb garden next year. We'll see. So I got that. As for fruit, because this is all fruit. I got the pears for the pancakes. These are just my Honeycrisp apples. They are my favorite apples. So I got three of those. Lime. This is for the pho and um, for quesadillas both. Two lemons. I think I put lemon. What am I putting lemon in? I know it's something. Oh my gosh, I blanked. Strawberries. Two things of blackberries and raspberries and bananas, the green apple, and a pineapple. I really love berries, as you could tell. As for breads and starches and stuff, I got um, whole wheat bagels. I think I'm going to try to make some kind of like breakfast bagel. I'm going to make the guacamole, like I said, I might put some guacamole on there. I don't know. I'll figure it out. White bread, this is Devon's. I do not eat white bread. I eat whole wheat bread, so this is mine. I got some rice noodles for the pho. I got some uh, thin spaghetti. This is for the lo mein. Now, I could not find lo mein noodles. And I looked online and it said that if you cannot find lo mein noodles, that spaghetti would work as a substitute. I really hope that it tastes the same. I guess we'll see. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's that's what I got for that. For that. This is Devin's. It's Mountain Dew. You wanted that. I don't know why I put it over here. It should be over there. Anyway, I'm sorry. I got lentils packed full of iron and all kinds of stuff. Quinoa. This was like a lot at Kroger. I really should have bought this at Walmart because it's cheaper there. But we were at Kroger, so I got it there instead. Uh, brown rice. Like a big bag of it. These. Uh, I love these. Um... I know what I know what I'm trying to call them burrito bread <laughs> what would you call these flatbread there we go there it is why did that take me too long that took me too long it's late at night I um, got some flatbread for like like a breakfast burrito maybe or maybe just a roll up in the middle of the day for lunch we'll see whole wheat tortillas for the quesadillas Devin got a bunch of these white flour tortillas. There's like three packages. I forget what he said he was going to do with them. But he got three of those for him. I put it over there because it's in the, you know, bread section. So I added his stuff there. Poison sauce. This is for the vegetable lo mein. Soy sauce. This is for both the vegetable lo mein and the pho. Uh, salsa. I'm going to add mango to it. I have a mango in the fridge. Add mango to it. Mango salsa. Ha <laughs> ha. Two things of coconut milk because I got this. It's a hundred percent cacao. And I know what you're thinking, Kristen, that is super bitter. That's what this is for. I'm going to melt this down, mix it with some coconut milk, and make vegan milk chocolate. I don't know how this is gonna taste. I don't know if this is a good idea or not, but hey, I'm gonna experiment. I might post it on social media and tell you guys how this went, but this was like my spur of the moment idea in the middle of the grocery aisle. <laughs> I got some sriracha sauce. This is for the pho. Might be for the vegetable lo mein too. We'll see. Vegetable broth for the pho. Unsweetened applesauce, not only to eat, because the girls like applesauce, but also to bake with, because I'm going to need this for pancakes. Two cans of corn. This is for the quesadillas, because I don't feel like, one, cooking the corn on the cob, and two, sh uh, shelling it, cutting it, you know what I mean in order to make quesadillas. So canned corn it is. Three cans of great northern beans, three cans of dark red kidney beans, and three cans of black beans. I, I just find it really easy 
to open a can, dump it in a bowl with some chia seeds, and boom, you can put that underneath of grilled vegetables. Super easy. I got some anise seed. I know you're supposed to put star anise and pho, but I cannot find it. I kid you not, both me and Devin were on the floor. We were looking up. I mean, we were everywhere trying to find star anise and could not find it. So to substitute, I got this instead. I really hope that it works and it's just the same. I guess we'll see. Please work for me. A can of diced green chilies. This is for the quesadillas. That was like last second. Oh, I'm going to put some green chilies in it. Guacamole sauce. Sauce? Seasoning mix. I don't know if this is going to taste good. I guess we're just going to see. Because it says just add avocado. But I know you're supposed to put like red onion and other things into guacamole. Not just, guacam not just the avocado. So I don't know how this is going to taste. But I figured we should at least try it. This is Devin's stuff right here. We both, Devin and I, we take a cart and we go our separate ways and then we meet. And then we go our separate ways and then we meet. I did not realize that he got juice for the girls. So I got two things of juice and he got one. Or maybe it's the other way around. I can't remember. We uh, Anyway, we both got juice for the girls. So they have three of them and yeah, I didn't. we didn't mean to do that. Uh, but anyway, spicy brown mustard and honey mustard is what he got. Two things of peanut butter. Devin likes peanut butter sandwiches with jam, strawberry jam. And he also got canned cheese. I've never in my life met anybody who eats canned cheese. But Devin does, and that's his. Cranberry raspberry juice for the girls, and two things of the white cranberry peach. The girls love juice. What can I say? These are Devin's. <laughs> that's his cookies. Um, tortilla rounds. Those are also his. Three of these, this is the Pringles Fiery Chili Lime, the Mighty Margarita Pizza, and the Super Cheesy Italian. I need to move these. These are all his. You're in the way, you're in the way. I don't know why he bought this, to be perfectly honest, because I'm not making anything Italian in the next two days. So, I don't know what this is for, but he got croutons. By all means, get what you want, Devin. I'm so glad he got these because I can eat these because they're rice crisps. <laughs> so I can eat these. I think I can eat these. I have to look at the ingredients. But anyway, he got two of the sweet chili and he got one of the chocolate and one of the kettle corn. We also got freezer stuff and fridge stuff, but we got home late and the girls really needed to go to bed and I needed to feed Andy and we had a lot going on. So by the time that we were able to put away the groceries, it was, it was, you know, getting a little thawed. So we had to put the stuff in the fridge and in the freezer. So I wasn't able to set it out and show you guys what we got from that section. I'm really sorry. But this is all the stuff that we got from uh, the pantry-like aisle and our vegetables. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want to follow me on social media, the links are down there below in my description bar. And I will see you guys tomorrow in a new vlog. Bye, guys.